What's up everyone, Dabblade here with another guide to Elden Ring. In this little video we're going to cover how to get and farm Somber Smithing Stones levels 1 and 2. Now Somber Smithing Stones are used to level up unique weapons, boss weapons, legendary weapons, so on and so forth. And so they are slightly rarer to get when compared to Smithing Stones. But in keeping with most things in Elden Ring, there is an easy way to get Somber Smithing Stones without having to rely on farming and killing enemies and relying on RNG for the items to drop from them. This is all thanks to the Bell Bearings. And so we are looking for the Somber Stone Miners Bell Bearing Level 1. So where do we get this item? Well, it's found in the Celia Crystal Tunnel. This is a dungeon located in Central Kaelid. So it is a little bit tricky to get to at early levels. But anyway, if you're heading to the Celia Crystal Tunnel naturally, follow the route I'm doing here through the rivers and lakes of Scarlet Rot at the lowest part of Kaelid until you reach the tunnel in the cliff face. Afterwards, it's a case of fighting through the diggers and the prawn miners until you get to the Falling Star Beast. Defeating the boss of this dungeon, the Falling Star Beast, will reward you with the Somber Stone Miner's Bell Bearing Level 1. But it's easier said than done. The Prawn Miners, for example, are quite tough, especially if you are low level. And speaking of low level, you can actually access the Celia Crystal Tunnel as soon as you gain access to Limgrave, and if you're up for the challenge. For if you head over to the location here, in the Dragon Burnt Ruins, there is a chest located here, to which will initiate a trap that will teleport you to around the middle point of the Celia Crystal Tunnels. This initially is supposed to be a trap for low players, putting them in a very difficult situation, being surrounded by tough opponents, but it's not impossible. However, I personally advise taking this dungeon on when you're a little bit higher level and more comfortable with the game. Anyway, once you have the Somber Stones Miner's Bell Bearing, head on back to the Round Table Hold, go over to the Twin Maiden Husks, and give them the bell bearing. This will allow you to purchase Somber Smithing Stones level one and two, four runes, as well as Glint Stone Scraps, which are little consumables that allow you to produce magic bolts. So I hope this little video helps, and until next time, I've been Darkblade, bringing you another guide to Elden Ring. Hope you enjoyed the video, thanks for watching, subscribe and like for more.